Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Patroni and in this video I will cover um, how to use iMovie and how to edit your videos and how to put text and pictures and move around text and stuff like that. Alright, so keep watching and make sure you keep on watching until this video finished to get all the information about iMovie and stuff. And this is not my real voice, this is a fake voice. I already made a video on how to change your voice using iMovie and yeah so let's get started so first up when you open iMovie you will have this thing or you can open up over here i don't know where it opens for, for, for me it opens at projects if it's not like that then update it this is the 2017 i don't even know which version all right so click on projects and then click on create new and then click on movie not a trailer movie and that will pretty much just load up the screen. You don't, you will not have anything over here, like over there. These are just my movie clips that I recorded of me playing video games, and this is just the music audio stuff. And you will not have anything over here too. It will be all blank if you are new to iMovie, of course. And all right, so let's get started. So first, what you want to do is you just grab your clip. Let me just grab it and drag it here. And over here you could like drag it down to zoom in the clip. So you could like put pictures and stuff on top. You know what? I'm going to make this clip very small. So I'm going to right click or double click and then split clip. And then just delete that. Now all I have is this clip right here. If I play that, that's nothing, just character moving. Alright, now I will add some text or my intro. So, if you have your intro, I already have my intro, which is right here. You see, I already saved my intro. I didn't make this intro using iMovie, so yeah. I use Blender. If you want me to make videos of Blender, make sure you tell me. Alright, so we were right here, just a blank character. Alright, now what I do is, I copied that intro and now I'll paste it over here. Command V to paste the intro. And that just pastes the intro over there and now moving on this is how I edit my videos so first up is my intro and then my um uh the video that I recorded and then at the top over here I put fake voice so people know this is not my real voice so in order to do that I just go in titles up over here at the right side I'm sorry left side and then just scroll down I just like to scroll down and i I always put this one, pull focus, so it basically like uh, blurs the background and then focus on the text. So yeah, now I, what I do is cut this, so again click on the text and right click and split clip. That will just split it and delete the rest. And now you will have title, if you play it it's nothing like, it will say title, see, title. And what you want to do to edit it, double click it and that will just highlight this. And I just, what I write is fake voice. And then click on this check mark. Let me make this clip a little bit bigger so you know what I'm talking about. Alright, so if you put a text like that, this is what will happen. Let me play that. You see, the fake voice will come up just like so, like that. Look, watch. Fake voice. That will pop up like um, slowly and blur the background and people can focus on it more than the video. Alright, so the text part, this part is gone. And now what I will make, uh, do is um, put pictures. Now what I do for pictures is click on this arrow. I'm just going to grab all those pictures that I made for this video. And for example, this picture right here, I'll just drag it from here and put it on top. And cut it out. Alright, so that picture now, it, it's on top of the video. But I don't want it like that. What do I do now? Well, click on the picture. And you see over here it says cut away. You want to click on picture and picture. Once you click that, the picture will be smaller. You just drag it. 
and put it wherever you want. I'm gonna put it right like bottom here so the bubble thing pops up over there. And make sure um, you go to this crop thing and put fit. Click on fit and then just check mark. And then once, oh, once again over here, you see this arrow? You're gonna drag it all the way down so it does not like, um, look, if, I, if it's right here, it's like faded in the screen. You see? Watch, let me play that. It like fades in the screen and then pops up and then fades away. But I don't like that. What I want to do is put it all the way down to zero and just play and the picture is still there forever until I delete the thing. So yeah. If I want to keep on moving this, then this is really simple. This is what I do. I press Command B to cut the picture. I just basically cut it a bunch of times like this. Keep on cutting. I know it takes forever. And now what you want to do is leave the first clip alone and go on second one. And then what you want to do is just basically drag it like here and click on the check mark. And then the third one, drag it here and click on the check mark. Fourth, just drag it away and I'm gonna leave that one alone. And then this one again over here. This one there. And when I play the clip, it will all move around and stuff. This one a little bit like there. And I'm just gonna leave that one there. So when I play this, this is what's gonna happen. Are you ready? Watch. You see what I mean? The picture like moves around. I don't know why it always plays the intro at the end. Alright, so this is what is gonna happen one more time. You saw that the, the picture of iMovie Tricks, it moves around in the screen. So that's how you move around a picture. You just basically put it on top of your video and then cut it a bunch of times and just move it wherever you want. So the picture will basically move around. So that's that and... Oh yeah, how to add music in your intro. It's basically really simple. You have to download uh, from YouTube or anything. Just download it on your uh, computer. And then over here, click on audio. And you will have your music basically here. And all you do is click and drag it under the video. Like that. And then you could adjust the volume of the music. Like for example, I'm talking right now. And I want the music really low so people can hear my voice. I basically put it up to like um, 7%. So it's perfect, like they can hear my voice and also hear the music that's playing in the background. But make sure you do not get copyrighted. Because if you do, the whole video will not have audio. So yeah, you don't want to get copyright. So I'm just going to delete that for now. And yeah, um, if you want to add transactions, it's really simple too. Just click on transactions over there and pick anything you like. And just add it between the clips. Like, for example, I'm going to add that between my intro and this clip. So let's play that. You see what happened? It's really confusing, I know. Let me, let me put it in somewhere here. I'm just going to drag another one. Like that one. So, like, my video is playing and then it drags and opens the other clip. So that's how you add transactions like that and at the end of the video I like to um, fade to black so it basically um, slowly fades the screen to black so yeah let me um, make it clear what I mean by that let me move that over there and play so it's playing and then basically it fades the screen to black at the end that means video ended so yeah that's pretty much it and that's how I edit my videos if you need any other help on how to um, put anything or make your voice fake. Let me let me just show you how to make your voice fake. For example, this audio right here. For example, if you record your um, intro, your um, voice will be under the blue bar over here. You see this clip of intro? The blue bar that will have audio. Just click on it and then click over here on this three dots. Filter. Um, it's filter for uh, the screen filter and the audio filter. 
So just click on audio effect. It says none. Click on it and pick anything you want from here. And then that will change your voice. That's pretty much it. It's really simple. So yeah, you can also add text from here. I use this one, pull focus for the fake voice one. But you could add anything you want. For example, um, let's say you want to just uh, add a little information right there. I'm just going to put, I don't know, hint. And then delete that. So that will just have a text like with the black bar like that in your video. So yeah, that's how you um delete your, I mean, edit your videos in iMovie. Hope you enjoyed this video and give a thumbs up. It helps me out. Thank you. Bye-bye.